Haiti's UN Ambassador Antonio Rodriguez has appealed for international support for the country in the wake of President Jovenel Moise's assassination. UN ambassadors stood to mark a moment silence for Moise during the General Assembly tribute. U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations, Linda Thomas Greenfield, said a delegation from her country had traveled to Haiti in recent days in response to the country's request for security and investigative help. Deputy UN Secretary General Amina Mohammed said that under Moise's watch, Haiti has seen the eradication of the transmission of cholera. In recent days, a U.S. government delegation traveled to Haiti in response to the Haitian government's request for security and investigative assistance following the assassination. Our delegation reaffirmed not only its close partnership with Haiti, but also its commitment to working in support of the Haitian people and democratic governance, peace, and security. We join the government and the people of Haiti in mourning His Excellency President Jovenel Moise. Under his watch, Haiti saw the eradication of the transmission of cholera. The last recorded case was reported in February 2019. Next year, we will be able to announce the full eradication. We would have wanted to witness this achievement together with President Moise. It was not to be. Haiti has had difficult times in the past. It is living through difficult times now. The United Nations stands with Haitians in a spirit of solidarity and partnership. The partnership that is grounded in helping moving Haiti from emergency approaches to long-lasting solutions. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.